Hello and welcome to the Engineer to You channel. In previous video, I made instruction how to control motor speed by PID algorithm via HMI on computer. With help of PID, motor can reach speed setting easily. In this video, I will show you how to control motor position via local web network. Now, you can use smartphone or iPad connected to network, then type address of local web server of motor. From here, we can control motor position disk by rotating the disk on web page. When we touch the disk on web page, it will send position setting to web server of motor, then rotate motor disk to reach that position setting on real time. Let's go in detail to see how it made. Before coming each step, please support me by subscribing my channel. Your subscribe and comment will give me a great motivation for next video. Thank you. To make this project, you will need Node MCU, HBridge LT98, motor with encoder, and other auxiliary like cables, motor base. The heart of Node MCU is ESP2866, which allows us to connect to local Wi Fi network. It also has GPIO, interrupt, and PWM function like others Arduino microcontroller. Take a look at circuit design. Motor encoder is connected to input pin 4 and 5, in which pin 4 also acts as an interrupt pin to count rotation of motor. Pin 12 and 13 acts as output pin to control motor moving forward or backward with help of HBridge LT98. Pin 14 is used with PWM function to control motor speed. In this project, it just push out a stable PWM to reduce speed of motor. Then, we made a circuit into motor base like this. The motor base is made from MDF wood cut by laser CNC machine. On source light circuit, motor base design can be downloaded at video description section of this video. Next section is a look about how to make local web server on Node MCU. First part is declaration for web server, next is setting for Wi-Fi network name and password. Following part is HTML code, which is used for local web screen. JavaScript library is used to make circle disk and pass value to node MCU. In setup section, we will turn on server and loading local web page and also JavaScript library. In HTML code, when the disk is rotated, disk value is returned and this section will get value. We convert it into number for position setting. When we get position setting from local web, loop program will control motor position to reach position setting. The code is done. We will move to upload section. Because the local web uses JavaScript library, so we will upload the library to file system of Node MCU. The JavaScript library is stored in data folder nearby the project file. In order to upload the JavaScript library to Node MCU, we have to install Data Upload Tool to Arduino IDE. It's easy to install Data Upload Tool. We just copy the tool file into Tool directory of Arduino IDE, then restart IDE. The code of project, also the Data Upload Tool, can be downloaded at video description section of this video. At first, we will upload JavaScript library to file system. It will take about one minute to finish. 
After finished file system, then we will upload the code as usual. OK, now we can test and enjoy the project. Thanks for your watching. If you like the project, please help me to share and subscribe my channel to see next project. See you next time.